Hey team, welcome back. I'm back out on the front lawn. I've been away and have not watered this for about the two to three week mark, same as the Tahoma. You can tell, well you should be able to see on camera, it's definitely struggling a bit. It's going that sort of gray bluey tinge. It's not helping also that um, the mower I'm cutting it with, it needs a backlap. I'll, I'll get onto that for the next mow. Uh, but right now I just want to get some products onto it. We're only a few days out from Christmas, but I'm pretty confident I can have this looking nice and green and lush. Um, so this needs a drink more than anything. That's what it will benefit from. But I'm also going to apply these two products today. Um, so you've seen me apply Tri Smart before. So this is the soil wetter. This is the surfactant um, from ICL. I don't think I've talked through it. So it's called Tri Smart. Tri meaning three because it's got um, three surfactant technologies in the one product. So the product is a penetrant. So it'll make sure that whatever you're applying, whether it's water, whether it's another product, it'll get down into the soil surface and through that hydrophobic layer. Um, so that's first and foremost a penetrant. Second, it's a dispersant. So it makes sure that when you actually spray it out and whatever product goes down, again, water, whatever, you, whatever you're putting with it, it'll actually go through the soil evenly. So you're not gonna have like patches of soil that are taking on water really, really well, and then patches that aren't. So it makes, makes that disperse evenly. And then the final thing it does, and the thing that I really like, um, is it retains moisture in the soil for longer as well. So those are the three things that this product does. Really worthwhile product um, if you're looking into it. I've used quite a few soil wetters, and this one's got to be right up the top of my list. Um, it's funny, the first time that you apply this, you've got to actually up the application rate. So when you read the application rate of this, I think the first application is 250 mil per 100 square meters, which is quite high. Um, that's actually on par with other soil wetters. They're about 250, some, I think some of them got to 500 mil. Um, but that is only for the first application. So from that point after, once you're on the TriSmart program, it's just 100 mil per 100 square meters, which is a nice low application rate. Again, um, have a look into value, do some maths, and you might find, or you probably will find, um, that in terms of value for money, pretty good, will last you quite a while. The second product I'm putting out today is Blade, part of the, I think it's Vital Nova range. Um, again, an ICL product this one I've done heaps of research on. So this might be controversial for me to say, um, but put it this way, there's a lot of biostimulants. There's a lot of seaweed products out on the market. Um, fun fact, the, I guess the industry or the market for these products has actually increased by 10% worldwide. So there's so many manufacturers and so many more products that that whole area of growth is, is growing by 10% each year. So there's a lot of money in that market if you can pick up what I'm putting down. Um, and it's funny because there's a lot of products available um, there's a lot of mixtures of products available that sort of, oh yeah, add this product and six others um, and that's going to be super beneficial to your soil. And I guess that market has come about because turf managers have sort of realised that you're not just after growth of the turf for it to look good, you're actually after uh, healthy soil. So there's a lot of products out on the market. Without going too far, what I will say is that very, very few products actually have any legitimate research or data behind them. Um, and they make a lot of claims. There's like, it, they're sort of seen as like a silver bullet type product, like it's going to fix everything in your lawn. Um, and I think what you'll find on most of those products is the people making the claim uh, is the company selling the product. I mean, 
I'm not jumping to conclusions. I'm just taking small calculated steps and conclusions are there. Um, but Blade is one of the very few products on the market, biostimulant, that is actually proven. Um, and it's not just proven by ICL, it's actually through independent trial data. Um, so what does it do? It increases the root mass. Um, so you'll get thicker roots, you'll get more of them. Um, but they also go down deeper, which is what we're after. Um, and the other thing it does is increase microbial activity. So if you want healthy soil, you want beneficial bacteria um, to potentially prevent disease. I don't think they've gone as far as claiming that. Um, this is sort of the product for you. So have a look into it. I'm not saying that you have to buy this one. I did a heap of research and this is where I've landed. Um, so what I suggest you do is if you're using seaweed products, have a look into them a bit further. Do they have any independent data behind them in the independent research? That means someone who's not affiliated with the company actually testing the product um, in a meaningful way. Um, I'll put links in the description to all the products that I'm using today and the nozzles because I do get asked that question a lot. Um, you can get away with just using a flat fan, um, but I've definitely noticed a difference when I use an air induction nozzle for my soil drench products. Um, less misting, less wastage, yeah, they're just, it's just better. Um, all right, so I'm gonna mix this up and get spraying and then water this in. Thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time on Long Care Australia.